You're watching Hexus TV and we're at Commerce 2008 over here in Taiwan. Over on the thermal take stand, we found ourselves a bit of water cooling going on. Uh, this is the thing down here, uh, and this is the PW880i Pro Water Series 24 centimeter CPU cooling liquid cooling system thingy. Um, it's a cooling system, okay? Ready made, plugs into everything, and you can see there they've got the water cooling block going through a little splitter there, so you call them the graphics cards as well. Come around here to the radiator at the back. Um, but there's some several features on here which um, I thought were worthy of mention. Um, first one here is um, a dimple tube technology. Okay, what this basically means is that inside the radiator, the aluminium radiator on the back here, there's um, dimpling inside the actual tubes of the uh, radiator. The idea being that it keeps the liquid swirling around as it goes up, so you don't get like you know uh, cool uh, liquid on the outside, a little, a little hot rod of liquid in the middle. It should always swirling around. It keeps it in flux, if you like. Um, it says here motorsports radiators, which I think is quite cool. Um, all aluminium radiator. Uh, there's a flow meter included, and then if we can get inside the case there, Aaron. See that curly stuff around the outside of the tubes there that are inside? That's a stuff called eye stripe. And basically what that is, it allows you to bend the tube uh, around much tighter angles but without the tube actually folding on itself. So if you've ever, ever had a garden hose kink up on you, because it's got a bit twisted, the idea of that surprisingly stuff is to prevent that happening, which keeps the flow rate through the tubes going much better. Um, the tubes are uh, 3 eighths of an inch uh, diameter, which means that you've got a nice broad flow rate there. Uh, something like 500 litres per hour through the pump as well. Uh, and that's basically uh, the PW880i uh, liquid cooling system from uh, Thermaltake. Oh, by the way, this is a redesigned radiator as well. This is a new design. So if you bought the old one, you need to go out and buy another one now. Um, would I have one? I don't really fancy having something that big hanging off the back of my uh, PC, to be perfectly honest. But if you're an overclocker and you're looking for a bit of extreme cooling and you don't want to go to the uh, Expressor around the corner, which you saw a bit earlier on, then maybe you would, would be interested in that. There you go. Uh, tip back soon on HCTV for more from Comitex 2008.